This is Tim and, Tim and Steve out in the wild uh, on the camera. Hello. We're featuring Greg, of course. And um, I think you just spat at me. Oh. Um, we're, we're actually finding some wild today instead of. We are. Dropping in, middle. in the captive wild. I scratched the balls off my lens. That's not good for yours, as you know. George, please, you're very busy. There's a, there's a mere cat right there. You might recognise him from those adverts about the mere cat. The Lion King. Yes, the Lion King. We're, we're on our way to meet George, the umbrella cockatoo again. Here we go, George, how are you? you Did he wave? Did you catch that, Steve? Yes. <laughs> Perfect. How are you, George? Like, he doesn't, he doesn't talk much talk. on camera, does he? No. <laughs> he's, he's a quiet, <laughs> quiet motherfucker when we film. Yeah. He, if I leave, just hold on for a second, oh. viewers. Oh. I'm going to go, George. Talk to the camera. Guinea pigs. And these are some guinea pigs. Oh. Oh, now you want to talk. No. Can you, have you seen the guinea pig? And if you look over here, you've got some monkeys. And we have a, a brown capuchin, as was made famous in the film Night at the Museum. Ace Ventura as well. Ace Ventura. And we have a white-throated capuchin as well, who's a bit uglier, I'll admit, but still rather adorable, if you'll just agree with me, because I'm right. And in here we have a bar now, but it's bugging all. Yeah, I couldn't find that earlier. Well, I assume it's because it's daytime and they're going to have night. I don't know about you, Steve, but to me, having nocturnal animals in a daytime zoo just doesn't seem to make much sense. Greg's still trying to get George to talk to him. He's <laughs> trying his best, but George just... I think George is bored. He's, he's not doing it for us. He's had enough. He's had enough. Even if I do this... Hey, George. Looking good. good. <laughs> he's just having none of it. He looks at me and... crawls. Doesn't even laugh anymore. <laughs> when I first said him laugh, I was like, oh my god. Come on, talk to him. <laughs> Oh, oh, almost. Oh, oh, he's getting angry. Oh. Or turned on. I'm not sure what that means these days. When I flare up like that, it usually means I'm relatively turned on. Oh. <laughs> you see him watching. Ah, excitement, curiosity, or fear. I was correct, viewers. As always, people who rely on my knowledge of oh, he's things. Coming over. He's coming over. He won't leave us alone. <laughs> yeah, he won't talk. Tim, what can you uh, tell us about this animal? Well, they're not. They're actually not well known for their uh, ability to talk. But some, some such as George, when he does it, <laughs> has developed quite a vocabulary, including saying "Hello, Tim," and freaking out <laughs> and well, laughing. I Say two again, I got a reaction. Two. No, Tim. Tim. Oh. Oh. Why oh. oh, seems to get a reaction. I wonder why you don't like my name. <laughs> Talk to us. Talk to us, George. Where's my fucking you money? Any, you haven't had any recent problems, George? Anything you want to share I'm with us? I'm stuck in a cage. <laughs> Tim won't talk to me. 
Anything you want to share with the viewers? I love when he was like, no! Oh? Oh, talk oh. to us then. <laughs> I, I think this this is a lost tour of yours. You done, John. Hang on. He's out, he's out of the right. And he's got, he was saying bye. Oh, we might as well walk this way so we can actually leave. Oh. There we go. He knows it's Back in the game, eh, George? Are you going to talk to us then? Are you going to say hello, Tim? I'll take that as a no. I'm going to leave. I've had it with your games. <laughs> hello. Hello. Because I said, where did you go? I went over there, George, because I had it with your bullshit. Are you going to talk to us? Hello. I just wanted to laugh again. That was so funny. <laughs> Crack wise. Ha 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 ha. This is so amazing. Oh. Hello. Do you like another food, George? Another food. There we go. I'm going to put that down there. Now talk. Why not good speak? Hello. Greg's left us for you. Otherwise occupied. George is very hammer shy. Speed it up. Hello. Uh, and then you walk away. <laughs> <laughs> You can tell it's fake. <laughs> look at it just turn and look. Why won't you laugh? Come on, make words. Uh, not a word. Three seconds before I leave and don't come back. See you later. Bye, George. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. <laughs> keep going. Let's just get around the corner. Bye, George. Get out of we're we're, we're going to wait here for a minute. We might pause filming, so when he starts shouting again, <laughs> we're going to come back. Wait, not again, no. Get one more. I just wanted to talk to us then. Right. No, no more screaming, you. <laughs> you scared me. Right, we're gonna go. Someone just dying. Hello. Oh, you just. Keep going. Hello. <laughs> oh, no, that is so pathetic. Come on. Hello. Hello. Please come back. It's so confusing. Oh, I wish it tasted like a cheese. That'd be a good selling point. Look at these guys, dude. Do you see these? These are Siberian chipmunks. What can you tell us about Siberian chipmunks, Tim? <laughs> they, uh, they're lodges which they construct on the ground, as you can see by this little 
you can't tell there's a cave. But he's dug a little hole under there. And then there's um, this guy. It's, just it's, it's a sort of herbivore. As you said, I assume that still counts, given that it's not a dinosaur. Not a person, not a he sometimes, he's not a very good one because sometimes he attacks bugs and oh, young he? lizards. Hello. So he's actually, oh, right? He's a convenience. I'm not being nibbled at, I'm not sure. Um, and he's part of the squirrel family, as you can see by its very squirrel like appearance. Oh! Sometimes they like oh. to, uh, habitat forests <laughs> and things. I don't want you to nibble me. Can we move on? Yeah. We could, we could move, we could move on. Bye George! Bye George! Bye George! <laughs> this is a bird. It's quite, <laughs> it's quite green. And they bite. And it's got a bit of blue and yellow on it. See? This is where we keep Greg when he's not working. Yeah. All, all, the, all the amenities are uh, good house near. Yeah. It's got a floor, Three -star house. a nice bit of wood. Yeah. That's all we give him. Yeah. And nice, you nice don't need to keep filming as we walk the entire way. Why don't I hold the camera and you... This is, this is a golden crested cockatoo. What well, can you tell us about that? They're from Indonesia. Oh, it's white Hello. and has a yellow bit. Sometimes oh. it talks. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it doesn't talk as much as George. <laughs> Although you haven't really seen George uh -huh. talk. Oh, oh, <laughs> he just said goodbye. Right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, is he laughing a lot as well? We should probably go. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to sleep. I think he's laughing as well. Oh, yeah. This is a you a pool of water, and over there, still nestled on that stone, is a, I believe, to be a spotted cane and ivy. Somewhere in here, there's a snake, perhaps, hidden in the log, or... Yeah, he's in the log. Greg! Yeah? The snake's in the log! Uh, here's another one, sliding along the wood. Greg, snakes, ah. snakes inside the wood. If we didn't mention earlier, viewers, this is Cleethorpe's oh. Jungle Zoo. It's oh. £4.80 entry, if you're a decent human. I was communicating with that bird. Otherwise, you could, you could, I'm going to be honest, you could probably crawl and sneak past the front desk, but you've got to be pretty fucking sneaky. This is, uh, this is home to the wonderful <coughs> miscellaneous tools of the creation of Jungle Habitat. World. Oh, as you can see, there's a, a bucket and a watering stone pot. Can. <laughs> and here is a massive snake that could probably eat you whole. Oh, my God, I can see him. I don't know where his head is. I think it's there. hidden around under its. What here's, is? here's the same snake, but what? What? <laughs> What can you tell us about this snake, Tim? He is white. So are spiders. Ah, oh, you are gorgeous. And very large. You are gorgeous. Oh, birds are screaming. If you'd like to come over here, viewers, you will see a weird axolotl. <laughs> sort of floating. Has legs. Swims, walks. Does a bit of whatever it feels like. What is he is a rebel. He does not play by the rules. Part of him wants to walk. Half him wants to swim. He's like us, but he looks like a fish. He's gorgeous. I'm just going to get a sneaky picture of this one, isn't If that's all the sea. He's all awesome. He's awesome. Look at him. He's pretty cool. That's another. MJ would like that one. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to tell MJ there's, before that bit comes up. There's a frog in there, so oh, we're going to wow. yeah. skip it's that guy. one. No, no. Thankfully, he's hidden away. What have we got in here? These are pythons, viewers, if you can see them. I can. There. There's one over there. Two of them. Two. They're all, they're all together. There's also... I meant to be one in there, but I can't see it. Let's skip the frog. 
Do you this be scared to death of me? Are we ending the tour here? And this is the end of Cleethorpe Jungle Zoo. Thank you for watching. This has been Tim and Steve in the Wild featuring Greg. Good night. <laughs>